Want to know how to add music to your Mixer stream? In this video right here, I'm going to show you exactly how to add music to Mixer using Batismo and Lightstream Studio. Let's dive in. What's going on? It's your boy Santana with Lions Among Sheep, where I bring you guys the best streaming tips and tricks. If it's your first time here and you want to learn how to grow and improve your stream and personal brand, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video every single Tuesday. Having music playing on your mixer stream in the background not only helps keep your viewers engaged, but it also kills any dead air when you're not speaking or when you're focusing on an important moment inside the game. So the first step that you're going to want to do in order for all the other steps that I'm going to mention to actually work is that if you're streaming directly from your Xbox using Livestream, you are going to need to have a Mixer Pro subscription. So you need to go to mixer.com forward slash pro log into your mixer account and sign up for the pro subscription which is $7.99 a month now mind you if you do not sign up for a pro subscription the steps that I'm gonna mention on how to add music to your mixer channel are gonna be irrelevant but once you've secured your mixer pro subscription you're gonna to want to come to batismo.com of course you can find all the links that I'm mentioning in the description below so batismo is gonna be the music player that we're gonna to use to play music on your mixer stream you're gonna log in with your mixer account and it's gonna ask you to authenticate Batismo with Mixer. You wanna select approve, and once you have approved Batismo, you're gonna see a connections page here. If this page is blank for you, simply refresh or try it again. Sometimes Batismo does go down. So you wanna make sure that your Mixer channel is listed and that is enabled. If you don't see this here, you simply want to select link on the right hand side and that's going to link your Mixer profile and make sure it's actually enabled. The next thing we want to do is you want to come to your actual Mixer channel. You want to select broadcast dashboard. You want to click on your actual Mixer name to go to your actual stream and on your actual live chat, you want to go ahead and type the following forward slash mod and then space at and you want to type in Batismo and you want to go ahead and mod Batismo. These are the two steps you need to do before we begin to add music or be able to play music on your stream. So what we're going to go ahead and do now is we're going to go ahead and add music to Batismo that you're going to be playing on your mixer stream. So on Batismo on the left hand side, you want to click on the actual music note to get access to the music player. Now out of the gate, Batismo does offer you some royalty free music that you can use if you like. However, I personally like to pull my playlist from YouTube. Now a question is asked whether it's okay to play copyrighted music or not. There isn't a set criteria or yes or no answer to that. It's more of a personal preference. If you don't feel safe playing copyrighted music, go ahead and play royalty free music or otherwise follow along and select the music that you want to listen to. So you want to go to YouTube and you want to type in the search bar, the kind of music that you want to listen to or your audience is interested in. I personally type in clean hip hop 2019 for this example. I'm going to search and I'm saying this is the playlist that I want to use. What you simply want to do is at the top, you want to copy the actual URL and then you want to come back to Batismo, hit add to queue and you simply want to paste the URL. Now this is going to pull all the songs that are on that playlist. Now you can freely go through this playlist and delete the songs that you don't want to showcase. Just make sure that you have enough songs to last the duration of your stream. So if you know you're streaming for four hours, make sure you have enough music in here to last that long. A lot of times streamers want to allow their viewers to be able to request songs. So on the left hand side, you want to select the music note and here at the top, you want to select edit song request. You want to make sure that this is enabled so that that way your viewers can request music. In order for them to request music, they either got to type exclamation mark SR in the chat, followed by the song they want to listen to, name and artist, or exclamation mark song request, followed by the song they want to listen to, name and artist. And then in here, you're able to dictate whether you want them to pay Sparks to be able to listen to songs and how many songs they can request before they have to wait. And then once you've done that, you simply want to hit save. And now your viewers are able to request music in the stream to keep the vibe going. Before we move forward, comment below and let me know what your mixer channel is if you want me to go ahead and check it out. 
So next we're gonna go ahead and add the actual Batismo music player to your actual stream using Lightstream. This is why the Mixer Pro subscription is required because this is the only way you're able to use Lightstream. If you're using another platform like OBS or Streamlabs OBS, you don't need the Mixer Pro subscription. You can just simply add the browser source to that platform and you'll be good to go. So on Lightstream.com and the link for Lightstream will be in the description below. You simply wanna select Lightstream Studio start streaming, select the platform that you're using. We're using Mixer. And then you want to go ahead and authenticate Livestream with Mixer by selecting approve. And on the left hand side, you're only going to see Mixer feed if you've never set this up before. So I've created this screenshot just to make it show you what it would look like if I was streaming. So here on the left hand side, you want to select plus add a layer, third party integration. You want to select Batismo and it's going to ask you to input an actual URL. So on Batismo, you want to come and select view music player overlay now here in the url you're going to see a link you're going to copy that go back to live stream and you're going to paste the actual url and hit enter now this is going to show the actual music player however i personally do not like the music player to show to my viewers so what i simply do is i make this as small as possible and i take it and i put it literally right behind my camera so in order to do that you want to go ahead and drag this below your actual camera and then what this is going to do is that it's still going to play on your stream, but it's not going to be visible to your viewers to cause any kind of distractions. Now, if you do want a video to show, then you can leave it up. However, I personally prefer to have it hidden. That way the music plays, but it's not able to be seen. So once you've completed all the other steps and you're ready to go live, all you need to do is come back to Batismo and hit this actual play button so that the music starts playing on your actual stream. And then here you're able to control the volume to decide how loud or how low you want the music to sound. Now, you do need to open up Batismo every time that you're going to go ahead and stream. I know it is an inconvenience, but this is the way it needs to be done. I also keep Batismo open because you can't type exclamation mark skip in the chat to skip music. So you have to actually do it manually by selecting skip to move on to the next song. So make sure that you have Batismo open or you can have it closed. If you know, make sure that your playlist is good to go. Otherwise, this is all you need to do and you should have music playing on your actual stream. If you run into any issues, I did go ahead and put the Batismo Discord where you can go there and ask any questions or have any technical difficulties. They'll be more than happy to assist you and address. So all the links mentioned in this video will be in the description below. Now that you know how to add music to your Mixer channel, how do you continue to improve and grow? I've created a Mixer streaming checklist with some handy tips to get you started off on the right track. The link to download the checklist is below. If you like this video, please let me know by liking it below, subscribe, and share it with a fellow streamer, and comment below if helpful if this video helped you. I'll see you guys next week. You know the motto, hustle, live, repeat.